Hey guys, Carby Barbie here with you again. So today I wanted to do something um, that I had mentioned in one of my, I think it was my favorite video. And it's called, it's, I mean, haven't, everybody has had this moment. If you do your own makeup, you have had this moment of, damn, my brushes are disgusting. <laughs> so I'm going to show you the way I clean my brushes. And this is like the temporary um, cleaning of the brushes like something that you need quick and now and is gonna get done really fast um, so I use um, this Mary Kay brush cleaner um, it does have alcohol in it so it is not recommended to go straight on the face which I don't know why anybody would put it on their face but maybe they think it's like a setter and it's not. It's it's just a brush cleaner. Do not use it for anything else. Um, then I use these Mary Kay face wipes. Um, you can find these online. And um, I'm a Mary Kay consultant, so I had these already. But this is what I, I like doing because usually I would use, I know there's different methods like um, the baby shampoo or uh, ugh, baby shampoo. I don't know, like the normal hair shampoo, but a lot of people like to use baby shampoo just because it has um, very little, uh, very less chemicals than what a normal shampoo would have. So, um, but this is, it, I mean, it's alcohol, so it'll kill a lot of the germs. Um, so this is what I do. I just grab the brush, point, and spray away, girl. Um, the best thing about this part, I, I spray it very generously. The best thing about this part, and then I grab this and just sort of swirl it. Um, again, the best thing about this part uh, is that I am able to, they don't, dry, it dries faster because it's alcohol. Um, and I can be as generous as, a, as I want, and it will come off quickly. Um, it's pretty scary, the colors that you get out of this, especially because this is like my foundation brush. And sometimes I'll go and retouch my makeup. Um, after I've done it and if you can see the colors are very good but there's some brown in there where it's like the foundation and then there's some pink where it's like the blush where I retouched you see that brown part that's probably my foundation my bronzer where I retouched and then just yeah it's it's a little scary so I do it once and I let them dry a little bit I set them on the side so what I like to do is I grab this I should have done this first and then I so you don't use too many of them. I tear it in half, or you can use scissors, but I mean, tearing is fine. And you just set it aside. So the clean brush is aside, the semi-clean brush is aside, and then this is what you're gonna be rubbing your brushes on. So this is my angled brush, and this all comes in the set of Mary Kay um, for, it's your brush set, I think it's like 35 bucks. It comes with a bunch of brushes and a makeup bag. I'll show you right now, in fact. And I just sort of, with this one, I like to go back and forth. And if you see, there's like black and black and brown, of course, because I do my brows as well. I sort of just like clean the thing. I like to do this part too, just because it does get dirty. And I usually, so it just won't go everywhere. And what gives me peace of mind with this is that they are clean just because they are, it, it is alcohol. So it's not going to be like, oh, it's, it's semi clean. Like this, this infects it. So, I mean, it has cut down. If I remember to do this, it cuts down into my, um, And it smells, oh, it smells so good. Besides, it doesn't smell as much like alcohol. It smells, um, if you can see that, that's like a lot of, this is my blush brush. So all this is leftover residue for my blush. Um, what was I saying? Blah, 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 blah. Um, I like this one because you really don't, you really have peace of mind after you're done. It's not, it's like that. 
that's pretty much it. I have a couple of more, and this maybe I should sh I should teach you how to clean one of my shadow brushes. This is um blah blah blah. <laughs> uh, this is my shadow brush. This is a Mary Kay. Um, I think it's a smudger. I can't read. It just is eye color, but I'm pretty sure I use it for smudging. So, um, and like I said, it smells really good. See, this is the side that I'm using. It's just wet, so that's why it has a different color to it. And like I said, I've used other methods to clean my brushes. And this is the one that has given me most more peace of mind. Only because I have noticed that I don't break out as much if I do remember to do it every couple of weeks or at least once a week. I will clean these brushes and I mean, yes. And if you just continue to do it consistently, then your breakouts will like minimize. Um, your brushes will be completely, um, it's, an, it's, it's alcohol so it's going to kill all the germs and everything and it lasts you forever this is probably um i'm gonna say like two months of use three months probably maybe i'm hitting the three month thing but i use it consistently um try to do it every couple weeks every week um two weeks at the most and i'll just remember well and it's super fast so after you're done doing your makeup if you have like five minutes left you could just this is my urban um Urban Decay brush, my naked Urban Decay brush, it comes in the palette. See, that's this is what it did. Um, and it's amazing. It's just awesome. So definitely look into this Mary Kay product. And if you're close to me, you can totally buy it off me. Thanks, guys. If you like my videos, please like the video and subscribe so you can get more stuff, more notifications for all my other videos. See you guys later. Bye.